Pai on that, and I'm an apprentice mechanic at Coventry City Council. Um, my name's Lee Smith, and I'm a level two horticultural apprentice at Coventry City Council, and I work at Candy Crematorium. My name's Lily, and I work as a business administrator for the Business Systems and Continuous Improvement Team. Uh, my name's Liam, I'm a customer service apprentice in the customer service role here at Broadgate House. I chose an apprenticeship because I used to work in an office, and it didn't really suit me at all. I wanted to have a more hands-on job and do some mechanics, and then I saw this opportunity pop up. On an average day, we get involved with uh, inspections, MOTs of the uh, bin lorries and HGVs we have around the yard, and the light vehicles too, so Ford Transits and Peugeots, Citroëns, everything we've got. And so far, I've enjoyed learning a new skill the most and getting hands-on uh, straight away with all my team and uh, making a few friends along the way. I've previously done an apprenticeship last year as a business administrator in Level 2, and my um, assessor actually pointed out that there was an apprenticeship going on in the Coventry City Council and it was to do with working closely with um, children's services which was something that I've always been interested in so I decided to kind of take it up and do the interview. So typically I control something called SCSM which is an incident resolve uh, system so if anyone has any um, issues with our software, such as data lock or capita, um, incidents come up to us, I will either call them or email them and resolve their tickets. Well, I'm hoping with the qualifications that I get from this apprenticeship, I'll finally have enough UCAS points to be able to go and pursue a career in uh, criminology by doing a university degree. So hopefully after this, I can either stay on at Coventry City Council and go to a new department and gain some years of experience, or I can go and pursue my career in criminology and law. I chose an apprenticeship because it's a good way to learn skills, uh, gain experience in business administration uh, and maths and, in, maths and ICT so far. Uh, for example, uh, I used to struggle very much at maths when I was at school many years ago. Uh, now, since then, I've completed a maths level 2 qualification here, so now I've got a maths qualification under my belt for the first time. You know, doing other things like promoting GoCV cards and you know, just generally speaking to, uh, speaking to residents of Coventry about most things. Uh, beyond my apprenticeship, I would like to work full-time in a role either within the council or outside the council doing what I've done already as in business administration, taking experience from both working and matching customer services and moving on to a full-time role. Um, I chose an apprenticeship because I wanted to learn and earn at the same time. And my average day consists of um, making sure the gardens are tidy, looked after. In certain seasons you've got mowing to do, pruning, hedge trimming, and just general maintenance of the grounds. Um, the things that I've enjoyed the most are um, being flexible with not having to go to college every day, you can get up once a month. Um, I can study in my own time and um, what I'd advise any apprentice that's interested in becoming an apprentice is um, if you think that you learn more with hands-on positions rather than just studying in your classroom, it's the, it's the thing for you. Give it a go. Get, Get involved, involved in the National Apprenticeship, apprenticeship Week 2020.